Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. So this video is about Nuggets latest version, which is version 5.1, which includes live video wallpapers as version 5.0 introduced animated wallpapers. So now you can use MOV or MP4 files as wallpapers. Mm -hmm. And in this video, we will see how we can use it using Nugget nugget is completely free and we are at its official github page as you can see it right here you can use it to customize your ios devices without a jailbreak and yes it works on the latest available ios 18 version we are using it on windows so the only requirement is to install itunes you can see these official links for itunes one from the microsoft store and the second one is from the official apple's website both will work just fine you can simply scroll down at the official github page and you can install itunes from here first once done you can simply scroll up and then get to the latest release which is version 5.1 currently and from there you can get the zip file for windows as you can see i already got it you can simply then right click and then hit extract all and you will get this folder right here if you open the folder you can see that you do not have to install python separately it is already built in and as a proof you can see that i did not install python separately now you can simply connect your device via USB and then open Nugget by simply right clicking and then running it as administrator. All right, you can check out the version on my device and in Nugget also. Yes, it works on iOS 18.4 or higher also. And I have tested it before making this video. This video guide is for educational purposes and the only purpose is to let you use Nugget to customize your device without a jailbreak with live wallpapers or with animated wallpapers. Now from the sidebar, simply select poster board and you can notice that with version 5.1, we have the new option to select videos as live wallpapers. You can simply select it, then hit modify. And if you want to use animated wallpapers, I already covered the 10 Ds feature to import the 10 Ds files and then use them as animated wallpapers. That guide is in the description for you if you want to check it out. So simply select it, then you can select either option reverse on loop or make it foreground which will hide the clock so it is up to you then from there you can choose video i already recorded a demo video for this guide so you can select mov files or mp4 files simply select it hit open or you can of course double click before you apply make sure that you turn off find my iphone or find my ipad after the process is complete you can turn it on safely and then from here you can simply hit apply and then hit apply changes you'll see that it is creating assets you can see the progress right here also inside cmd and after some time your device will reboot please do not unplug it until the process is complete this process can take some time all right you will see all done and you will hit ok all right as you can see the device rebooted now to apply the live video wallpaper simply go to the lock screen press and hold and then hit this plus button and you'll see it right here under collections if it is not appearing it will appear eventually in a few seconds simply select it you can see it is actually a live video wallpaper simply hit on add then hit set as select it and you can see it is now set it is a proper video live wallpaper and it works just fine you can see it is looping and it works without any issues now as for the length of it it is a seven seconds video which i have used as a wallpaper so you can try for yourself now if in case you want to get back to stock you will simply select a default wallpaper and now to remove it go under poster board hit on 10 days and from there you can clear collections wallpaper simply hit it and you will see this message right here then hit apply then apply changes and wait for the process to finish your device will reboot hit ok 
now when you check collections you can see it is now removed from the collections that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care